Let's do this. Three, four, five, six. All right, so um, I know Bassman did the deck thing. It only works over on Twitch, unfortunately. YouTube hasn't figured it out yet. So um, the rough idea with our deck is to get a resource generator out and to build out and use about four rounds of this and then to go. So telekinetic attack. Um, it's not terrible. All right, superpower training is interesting because we can search for um, each player may search their deck and discard pile for identity specific upgrade and put into play. That's pretty good. We can get X gene for a resource generator. A double is nice. Um, do we want telekinetic attack? Psychic blast is useless right now for us. It's not really worth it. To me, or is allies the lifesaver? Is there a good deck? Hardly any allies. Yeah, they exist. I'd have to think about it, but they do exist. I, I've done like perfect protection decks and they don't use a lot of allies. Maybe they'll do Age of a Apocalypse. Uh, hey, do I wonder? Uh, most likely Age of Apocalypse will be the next one. Next box. Something with Apocalypse. All right. Telekinetic Attack. That is a lot of damage. I just don't know if we need that yet. All right. Let's dump both of these. Let's dump both of these. All right. Let's draw that. One, two. All right. Mind Control is not really what I was thinking. <laughs> Okay, so let's throw away mind control to put an X gene. X gene gonna give it to you. Um, bu -bu -bu -bu. Let's flip up to Phoenix. Let's use a Phoenix counter. Um, shoot, all right, let's use a double to get superpower training in. Comes in with three. Rush decks don't use it. Yeah, that's a good call too. That is very true. Psychic Blast will throw away to get Endurance. One, two, three. All right, so we're thwarting three. Hope Summers thwarts three. So Hope can thwart three off a of superpower training. So we may search our deck and discard battle for an identity specific upgrade and put it into play. We could get the suit. We could get her shield. We can get her shield or her suit. What does her suit give us? That would be good. Oh my gosh, where'd it go? <laughs> uh, we could rise in the ashes, which actually might not be bad either. The suit gives us steady and then retaliate. Or we can just take damage to the face and won't bother us. We're going to take damage to the face and will not have it bother us. Uh, I use the put in endurance. I want to say, I think. Is that what I did? I played too fast. So we flipped up, used one for, oh my God, would even use it for anything. Just... <laughs> I just assumed I was going to use it. All right. So I didn't even use my Phoenix counter. So I'm up to four still. I don't even want to be at four. All right. Um, and then we could thwart the one off of here. The new decks the past couple days as well. All right. Let's ready up. Ready up hope. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before, I need to put her shield on. Chat. I need to put her shield on. There we go. All right. Uh, psychic Assault, double team building, Psychic Assault, and Colossus. Okay. All right, so two goes on here. Sinister is going to attack us after a status card is placed on Mr. Sinister. No, we're not doing that. All right, so he's going to attack. We're going to just take the hit. That's fine. So it's going to be one, two. If this villain's attacking, he's overkill. Doesn't really make a difference. All right, so two goes off of her shield. Cool. Retaliate and teamwork of Nasty Boy. 
All right, that's Archer. We're gonna just punch him in the face, right? Just knock him out, probably. <laughs> Let's use a double to play team building exercise. Okay, let's do team building, X gene. Oh, wait, that won't work. We'll use team building and Colossus to play psychic assault because uh, we are psionic. So we can use team building. Um, deal three damage to Ramrod. We get retaliate one. Take the retaliate. All right, good. Then we'll just exhaust, not get the last damage off of Ramrod. So he's gone. Hey, Grimlock, how's it going? Uh, considering the champions, uh, I would love to see X-Men versus Avengers campaign. That'd be heroes versus enemies and which side issues. That'd be cool. I just don't know if they would ever do it. Uh, Hope is going to thwart this off. The only reason is because they only have a contract for three years. Have you tried Domino Protection yet? Not yet. Not yet. I had to do it like tomorrow during the day or something so I can uh, review Domino properly. Uh, we're going to hold on to Psychic Assault. Two, three, four, five. Okay, not quite what I wanted, but that's fine. All right, two goes on to here. Two an attack, we're gonna take the hit. So it's gonna be one, two, three damage. Oh no, my shield. No, no, well. Back card is? All right, Sinister Soldier. This plus one scheme, plus one attack for each superpower attached by Mr. Sinister. Okay, so he's a little stronger than your average bear. All right, so. Let us. All right, so what we'll do. Uh, God, it's going to be scheming for so much. One, two. Let's dump three cards to put extra in. Oh, yeah, my shield should have. Yeah, you're right. We could increase that by one. Uh, so it wouldn't have changed anything because it would have had only two things on it and then the three would have hit it. So that's fine. So let's do... Another Psychic Assault. Uh, we'll do X-Gene... Or not actually, I'm sorry. Team building and X jet deal three damage. It also confuse that enemy. Um, we could do a damage, so it's up to four. Hope can thwart the two off. Or yeah, two off. Uh, that's ready up. One, two, three, four, five. All right, Sunfire Angel. Man, I'm getting all my second salt. Build support is cool. Except the thing I wanted to use on was X Jet. <laughs> do domino aggression yet? I don't know if we're gonna do that. We did the domino aggression already, didn't we? Using domino protection, really like it. Hey, Mister Thought. Yeah, domino domino protection is really good, for sure. Oh, we can get scimitar in. That's what we want to do. <laughs> okay. Two goes on the here. He's going to attack once again. We'll just take the hit. That's fine. It's going to be one, two damage. He's going to attack now for two, right? Because he's got one superpower. So we'll just take that hit. One, two. Bad card. What was that? Four turns? That's not bad. <laughs> All right. Well, at least we have something else to try to do now. All right, steady, tough, and villainous. All right, so now the game has changed a bit. Okay, all right, so this comes on with six, two, four, six, which means this is on. She comes with steady and tough and villainous. Okay. Okay, 
Okay. <laughs> Let's start Guardians of Most One. I think. Oh wait, I think I like the X Men cycle. It was the best. Um, it's X Men is probably my number two cycle behind uh, Sinister Motives. I'm going to start Guardians Most Wanted. Likely going to skip Ronan. Any tips for dealing with the collector? Uh, event heavy. Um, people do well. Like Gamora does really well as long as you don't use chump blocking. But like just anything event heavy will do well, I think. I don't think it will be as bad as, as what you've probably heard. Ooh, we could put the clone on. All right, so let's do X-Men. All right, let's use team building and X-Jet to play Sunfire. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let's do... Let's use a Phoenix counter to put in build support. Not gonna do anything yet with it, but it's just nice to have. Um, and then what we can do is let's dump two cards to put Angel in. You're my angel. Hey, Vulture, how's it going? Thank you for the follow. I appreciate. It. Hopefully, you're doing well today. Hey, CBAV, this matchup looks fun and thematic. Is there a way to see your deck list on YouTube? Um, yeah, let me just, let me just put in chat. Hold on. Uh, copy. Actually, here, let me just pin this for now. All right, it should be in, uh, in chat. Okay. So what we can do with this. Is Hope and I are both going to thwart three. To get rid of consume the world. Well, not get rid of it, but it's off to the side, right? Angel can deal damage to this guy. Knock him out. He's gone. Sunfire. Oops. Can knock the tough off of this. All right. And then we'll ready up. Need some Miles action? That's true. I haven't played Miles in a while. Two, three, four, five. Is Angel an auto include ally for you? <sighs> hey, Will, it how's it going? Um, not auto include. He's probably like seventy percent of the time. I would say, roughly. Wolverine, Power of Mind. I have three Power of Minds in here. I'm running the bottom of this deck. Oh, but we're gonna crush it with Psionic soon. Firebird, Power of the Mind, Wolverine. Actually, we're probably going to use Wolverine is what we're really going to do. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Double. Oh, okay. We have an interesting hand coming up. Okay. So we're going to put two on here. What is an overrated hero in your opinion? Uh, Doctor Strange is by far the most overrated hero. Also depends what you mean by overrated. I think Doctor Strange is the most boring hero in the game. I hate playing him. Was unavoidable with that question. <laughs> if you're if you're gonna if you're gonna give me the assist, man, I'm gonna dunk it every time. All right, so <laughs> Mr. Sid is just gonna attack. What do we have? Eight life. I'm gonna let this hit me. So it's gonna be one plus nothing. Let's freaking go. Dark Phoenix, though, I'm gonna have Sunfire take the hit because she is villainous. So it's gonna be two, three, four damage. Really crushes Sunfire. All right, back card. Hey, Beast Note, how's it going? Uh, Sinister Strike, Hero. Mr. Sinister attacks you. If he has the aerial trait, you are stunned. I'm not stunned. Uh, he can just hit us. That's fine. So it's going to be one, two, and we're confused. Oh, no. Two damage. One, two. I do need to flip down at some point. <laughs> it's the best idea ever. I don't really like Cyclops either. What's the most underrated X-Men hero? This one. People think she's bad. I don't think she's bad. That's, but that's awesome. Just, I've always felt that way. Um, I feel like also, 
I don't know. Shadow Cat's not really underrated, but I feel like she kind of is. Because people, like, like she's really hard to grasp your head around. Or, like, put your head around. Um, And I get it, because I have a hard time with her, too. But, like, she's really good. Okay, so... What I want to do is destroy everything. All right. We're probably going to have to flip down at some point and heal. But not today. Um, okay, so I want to play Wolverine for sure. For sure, for sure. So we'll use X-Jet, team building, and two cards to play Wolverine. I'm going to use... Shoot, I'm confused. I think we're going to have to get another Mr. Sinister thing in here. He's going to have to power up with other stuff. I don't love it, but it's probably going to be the way to go. Because what I do want to do is use Hope to thwart the three off of build support. And then we can look for a... Uh, Card support three or fewer, which we want. Oh, wait, shoot, the support? No, I was thinking upgrade. I don't think we have any supports. No, poor deck planning. I should have had a helicarrier in here. All right, I take that back then. We're just going to leave it off to the side. I should have had a helicarrier. I did not plan that well. Suffer through one more picture for me. I got sleeves today. Nice. I love Shadow Cat. Shadow Cat's so much fun. Every time I play Phoenix, she bump up my ranking. Rogue is underrated, but that's the that's just the solo bias. Multiplayer, she's crazy. I still don't think Rogue is that good. That's also just me. <laughs> Canadian, has it going? Good to see you. Play more Shadow Cat for sure. Yeah, and like her timing mechanic is really weird. It's the same with like Miss Marvel. Rogue is so overrated, at least fun wise. Yeah, that's how I am too. All right, so Hope is gonna thwart three off of here instead, because. I forgot I didn't have an upgrade. Oh, I should shuffle these two. Okay. So we are then going to use Power of the Mind because it's Psionic and X Gene to deal seven damage on the Dark Phoenix. Five, six, seven. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Okay, cool. Angel is going to do two. Wolverine is going to do three, knock out. Dark Phoenix. See ya. Okay, so. Um I feel like we're built out. We just do we need to heal? I feel like I should flip down and heal. And I also should have had a better support. Oh, because I was gonna use this for X Jet, that's right. And that was the whole idea of this. Uh, it has to be Spencer. Wait, wait, wait. For support with three costs or less. Oh, you're right. I was thinking of um it had to be gray, but you're right. I could have put white hot room in. Alright, so we'll leave that. Because you're right, right. That's a good call. We could do that in a little bit. But I still should have thrown three off of there. Um last so play also you could play as a three. It's a great review of how cards interact with kitty. Very helpful for a new. Yeah, it's good. It's it's the same with um like Miss Marvel. Like if you understand Miss Marvel, Shadow Cat makes a lot more sense. But under understanding how response windows work is kind of like it's tough. Um never feel bad about like having a hard time with it because like I still struggle with it now and again. And I played a lot of those two heroes. All right, so the question is. I think we might wait to flip down. All right, this is my new thought process. We're going to confuse him because we should have X coming at some point and he's going to give it to you. So we'll wait and we'll heal then. So let us um, just remove the confuse and then ready up. I also need to start using more of my tokens. I feel like I'm not using as many as my Phoenix counters as I want. One, two, three, four, five. X going to give it to you? No, X is... I mean, okay, here's all my allies. Oh, but Psylocke too. Okay, that's good. Scimitar, I really want to get in the play so we can do that. And then Psylocke, we can get in the play. Oh, here we go. Now we're going to be making some moves, chat. Okay, so this isn't going to go up by two. 
That's fine. He's going to attack. Angel's going to take this. It's going to be one, two, three. Ooh. 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 It's four damage. Ouch. Ouch. Bad card is... Ruckus. Teamwork with Nasty Boys. Warrior revealed. Stun each character you control. Okay. Don't, don't enjoy that. That's for sure. All right. So everyone's stunned. That's really not helpful. Uh, my turn... Wolverine gets to heal one. Let's use the power of the mind to put Scimitar in. God, I love that card. I love Scimitar. All right, so what we'll do is we'll throw away two cards. Three, four. Actually, no, no, I don't want to throw away two. I'm going to hold on to the Cyclops. And we'll use a, a Phoenix counter to put Psylocke into play. Snow, uh, Snow Guard? The one where you can adjust it and like decide the three things. That's awesome. It's a great card. I think it's Snow Guard. Oh, when she came in, we could do Scimitar to deal two damage. Ooh, two damage. We're going to thwart with hope for three. Just take that off. I'm going to clear my stun. Psylocke is just gone. What do we have? Five life. Psylocke is just going to do a damage and knock out Ruckus. And we're probably going to take a hit. Um, and then we'll clear our stun. And then ready up. We're still holding on the Cyclops. Two, three, four, five. Okay. Snow Guard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is amazing for real? Agreed. Agreed. She's a lot of fun. She's so versatile. All right. Two goes on here. It's going to attack. I'm going to defend this. So defending two... The villain is attacking against Overkill. Um, two against our two does nothing. So that's sweet. No, discard and upgrade or support you control. No. No. Shoot. Do not like that. Actually, do we just... Oh, well, no, not yet. Um, all right. So, let's discard... Let's discard X-Gene. Sad. That's just the easiest one to try to get back in. Hey, BB. How's it going? Hope you're doing well. All right. So... Let's... Um, let's get a Cyclops in, right? So, Hope Summers does not count against our ally limit that's how we can have four so we'll use a double and team building because he's also an x-men to put him in in doing so we get to put two more counters on us so that's something um let's use our counters yeah we'll use one counter to play phoenix firebird and then we'll remove a counter to ready phoenix Oh, sorry. We should heal Wolverine as well. Um, okay. Now Psylocke is going to deal. Shoot. She's going to knock herself out. That's all right. Because we're going to confuse. So Psylocke is going to knock herself out. Because she's going to get retaliated. And deal one, two damage. Onto the villain. So Psylocke's gone. Wolverine... He's going to take three damage because he's going to get retaliated and deal three damage. One, two, three. Cyclops is going to deal two damage. One, two. Get retaliated. So he's got two on there. Uh, Hope will thwart off of here. We are going to use our double for the power of the mind to play telepathic trickery to get rid of this build support. So then we can put in, what do we say? White hot room? That's what we were looking at. 
Yeah, white heart room. We will flip down. We will heal three. One, two, three. Um, we could put one more Phoenix counter on. That's fine. And then we can exhaust white hot room to heal two more. One, two. Oops, that was too many. Ten? Okay, cool. And then let's ready up. Oh, also we did a psionic card. Um, so I should exhaust this and deal two more damage. And then we get retaliate one as well. Sorry. All right. One, two. I love that art. Got to get that one. Dude, the art's so good on this. As much as I complain about OP stuff. And you all know. I complain a lot about the OP stuff. It is, it is gorgeous. What they did was gorgeous. I mean, I, I got to get it now for, for X-Force. It's going to be a pain to get. I'm going to have to pay a lot of money, but it's gorgeous, though. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Big attack cards. Big attack cards. And there's Axe. Oh, Psylocke came back. Interesting. Psychic Blast might not be terrible. Okay. Wait, did you get Shadows already? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was only like fourth turn. <sighs> All right. It's a kid. Maybe just sell them directly, FFG. Dude, don't get me started. Don't get me started. I swear, that's why FFG doesn't like me, because I, I yell about it nonstop. My next thing is to try Juggernaut, Sinister, and Strife without hope. Let me know how that goes. Where do you get your variants? Like the art variants? These I got from 401 Games, I think. And then, uh, yeah, I think 401 Games. Your X-Men kits? I hope I can get one. That's awesome. Offer them lots of money and see if that works. I don't know if it will. And then tell them that you know a streamer that's moderately famous among small circles of people that have somewhat heard of me on the internet. And I'll promote their store. And I'll buy it. <laughs> just just give it to me. It's brutal. Yeah, dude, it's rough. It is rough. All right, so he's confused. Two on there, confused. We got two backwards. First one is... Hey, there we go. If you have the Unleashed trait, I'm not. If you have the Restrained trait, remove one power counter from Phoenix Force and this card gains Surge. All right, so remove one. That card gains Surge. Uh, Teleport it away. This comes in with four. I laugh at four. Force to interrupt. Mr. Sinister cannot take damage. When Mr. Sinister would attack, he schemes instead. Whatever. Whatever. We're going to clear that so fast. I'm not even worried. It's a joke. Gorgeous George. I don't even like you anymore. Gorgeous George. Uh, when Gorgeous George attacks you, exhaust a character you control. We won't allow that. All right, cool. Cool. Man, do we just go for the win at this point? I feel like it's just time to just go nuts, yo. All right, uh, Wolverine heals one. You're going to try Baldur's Gate 3 considering it's D20 related? Uh, when it goes on sale, I will. Yeah, for sure. It's going to hate our money. We're glad they throw more at them. I would throw so much money at them. It's insane that they don't let me give them money. It's a really weird marketing plan, I'll be honest. I don't fully understand it, but you know. Whatever, I guess. Okay, so uh, first thing we're going to do... Is exhaust white hot room to heal two more. One, two. Let's flip up. So, what we're going to do. Let's think about this. X can come in the door. Ready us up. One, two, one. Okay, wait, wait, wait. That could be one, two. One, two, three. All right. So I'm going to. Hmm. I wish I could thwart for one more. We do telepathic trickery though. All right. Let's, let's rethink about this. You sponsored by them. No doubt. They have a few. So listen, <laughs> it'd be so expensive for them to sponsor me. Other companies, 
free. Them? Because they won't sell me the stupid thing straight? It's like 10 grand. Okay. So here's my rough plan. Here's my rough plan. X could ready us up. But that's a chump move. So what we can do instead is we can do Cyclops with telepathic trickery. I'm sorry, Cyclops to do two. Knock him out, we become unleashed. Telepathic trickery can remove four from here. And we'll be unleashed. And then we get stun and confuse Mr. Sinister, which I think when we put the confuse on, I don't remember if we put one on here or not. I'm going to say we forgot to. So we have to do that still, which is fine. So we can play that for free. Psychic Blast. We could drop... If we did that, hold on, let me think about this. Four damage on Psychic Blast isn't good enough. So we could do one, two, put Sunfire in as a blocker. Yeah, we might do that. Okay. Okay. I think we got there. This isn't staring yet, except for that one time. <laughs> Let's use one of our counters and throw away Psychic Blast to play combat training. So we have plus one attack now. Now, I'm going to have Cyclops deal two damage here and knock himself out. In doing so, I lose two counters. I am now unleashed. It is time to go. So we have minus two thwart, but we have plus two attack, which means we're swinging for a plus three. So swinging for four, which means Hope Summers is swinging for four. We then can use team building an X jet to remove four threat from here and stun and confuse an enemy. Sorry, we're now that's fine. Um, if I stun and confuse, it advances focusing in. Do we want to advance it? I guess it's not the worst thing it advances. Um, yeah, let's stun and confuse him. Stun and confuse. This advances, right? Because we have to, after status cards, place them in the center, take one threat in the main scheme. Okay, so we have to do that. 2A comes in. Super strength attachment. So he gets plus one attack. And we have to shuffle these in. This gets one. Now. Uh, we get to exhaust Scimitar to knock out Gorgeous George, who's not so gorgeous. Maybe not named George either. We're going to throw away two cards to play Sunfire. What do I have? 11 life? I'm going to swing for four. One, two, three, four. I get Retaliate one. Hope is going to... No, no, no. Hope's going to clear her stun because we're going to need her attack soon. Sunfire is going to thwart for one. Off of the main here. And then we're going to ready up. Oops. Wolverine stays readied up for now. Because. Well, he's going to get retaliated. But we'll just save him. That's fine. One, two, three, four, five. Still bad. What are you talking about, man? I'm crushing it. Oh, we get the shield in. Oh, my God. It's so easy. It's so easy, chat. It's so easy. Canadian. Thank you for the prime sub. 10 months in a row. Getting close to a year. It's nuts. It's nuts to think it's been about a year. All right. Two on here. Mr. Sinister is stunned. Um, all right. So attached villain gains the brute. Oh, no. He gains steady now. So he's not stunned, which is fine. He gains the steady trait, which is fine. All right. Cool. Then he's going to attack. Sunfire is going to take this. It's going to be one, two, three, four, five damage. Sunfire gets knocked out. My card is 
the soldier. All right, so he gets extra attack. He's a little strong now. He's a little strong guy. All right, so we're going to flip Mr. Sinister. Yeah, I think we're going to flip him and then we're going to go. Flipping the old flip and go. All right, so let's use a double to play Telekinetic Shield. Chat, what happens first, retaliate or consequential damage? All right, this is a psionic card, so I can exhaust Scimitar and deal two damage to knock Mr. Sinister into next Mr. Sinister stage. Steady, stun, retaliate. Uh, when reveal, place one threat in the main scheme. It would be two if there were fewer than two superpower attachment. There are two, so there's not fewer. So he comes in with 17 life. They always takes an ad break. That's how they get you. <laughs> I think Phoenix is cool. She's interesting for sure. Yeah, I love her. I love her. Okay. Retaliate. We knocked him in the next stage. Does he still retaliate then? I always thought he didn't. Well, if he retaliates, he takes off the shield. Was the listen for the retaliate? I what, what was the wasn't there a rule back in the day that even if they have retaliate on their name like Zola like did was that a recent change when you hit retaliate? No retaliate. He still retaliate. I don't think he does though. I don't. Th now hold on. Now I gotta look that up. I feel like they changed it. I feel like it was one way and then they changed it a different way. Uh, retaliate. I can't spell. All right. The character must. Uh... All right. So after a character with the retaliate X keywords defeated, deal X damage to the attack. Blah, blah, blah. The character retaliate must survive the attack to deal damage. Uh, the order of resolution. Retali All right. So abilities that trigger retaliate. Take any amount of damage, retaliate, and then after it, okay, that, that doesn't help at all. I don't know what your earlier comment was. That Phoenix is bad? Psychos is better than Phoenix? No, we all know that's untrue. I thought the villain that's, uh, so, hold on, wait, wait, is there a Hall of Heroes ruling on it? Oh, God. Um, what would it be? Probably under Zola? Because I feel like I've heard it both ways now. Um, Zola. Oh my god, hold on. I got a bit too... Uh, okay, Zola has one HP left on stage. Rocket has energy barrier and play with one token and one card. He plays Haymaker. Now several things happen, I want to make sure I do more. Rocket responds with dealing excess damage by drawing a card. Okay, so... Hold on. So really quick, they go in this whole thing. So he only has one HP left. Rocket plays Haymaker on Zola 1. This attack has excess damage. Hay Haymaker is discarded. Zola 1 is removed. Zola 2 is revealed. Rocket responds off the attack he made. Draws one card. This empties his deck. Haymaker is shuffled into So Zola's retaliate triggers. Yeah. So this is the, the, the Haymaker or the uh, retaliate would trigger. Okay. So now we know. The same result retaliate, then you must resolve it. That's, so, that's such a weird rule. I mean, it's cool. It's, I mean, it's all good, but that's that's fine. I'm happy we got to the bottom of that. Okay, so we have to get the retaliate, right? So we took the one off, so we're still good. Do people play Rocket? Yeah, he's not bad. It says dealing consequential is the last thing. 
Ugh, okay, that's fine. That works out poorly for us, but that's fine. <laughs> All right, so we're going to throw away two cards, exhaust team building and x because we are X-Men to put in Colossus, who goes with toughness. Okay. He's got 17 life left. I'm going to thwart one with hope. Yeah, champion. That's how I always assumed it was, too. Main scheme should be at four. Why? What did I miss? All right. Oh, because I only put one on. So I come here, let D20 figure out the rules of this. <laughs> all right, all right. So wait, it had four. We exhaust the hope, sound the three, right? Sound the three. We still need to be down one more. Everything carries over from stage as far as I'm well. So the only thing that doesn't carry over is a main scheme. If there's tokens on a main scheme to the next scheme, it doesn't carry over. That I know. Because that's like the whole thing with, with mutant and whatever. That's why it like always confused me. Like things carry over here. Things don't carry over here. But to be fair, villains are the same. Schemes aren't, right? So it's just... Like re reorienting your mind on that. All right, so let's have Wolverine thwart one. Oh god, that feels gross. Um, we will swing for our four damage and get retaliated one. Strictly for no, 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 that's fine. I just want to. I know some people sometimes one, two, three, four. Like get confused with that stuff. Not saying that you were you were wrong or anything. Okay. So Colossus. I feel like we should swing with the three because we have the shield. Well, he's going to swing for a lot. Does he have 13 life? Ugh. No, no, we'll just, we're ready. Up. We'll play it safe. We'll play it safe. There's no reason to rush this. We should have the win, generally speaking. One, two, three, four, five. Big hit, big hit, big hit, big hit, big hit. There it is. Yeah, we easy have the win. Game is easy with Phoenix. All right, two. Um... He's going to attack for three. Let's have Colossus take this. It's going to be three, four, five. Max is tough. This dude's going to attack. So this guy gets plus two attack for each or plus one for each uh, superpower on him. So he's swinging for three. Uh, I'm going to take the hit. So telekinetic shield's going to go away. Because you're using Phoenix, uh, I'm about to prove otherwise. Where reveal? Oh, uh, give Mr. Sinister tough stats. Oh, come on. And he does have the brute, so he deals four damage. No, he heals four damage. One, two, three, four. Oh, okay, so now he has a tough status with. All right, so hold on, that changes things now. So after a status card is placed on him, we have to add two threat, which means this now pops. God, that's annoying. Deal each player one face down and counter card. So wait, we still have to do that. When Mr. Sinister attacks, he attacks Hope Summers instead. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. So we still have to do this in counter card because technically we still have to like finish this up, right? Or reveal. Discard the upgrade you control with the lowest cost, highest cost instead of the villain psionic. Okay. Um, highest cost psionic would be X Jet. That's fine. I don't need that. That is fine. Okay. So do we just win now? Is that what we should do? I think we just win now, right? All right, chat. All right, Wolverine heals one. I knew it. There's nothing to know. No, the problem is Phoenix is too good. 
She is too strong. Because Wolverine is going to knock himself out to knock off the tough. That's fine. Don't even care. Wolverine gone. Hope is going to deal uh, four damage because that's what we swing for. One, two, three, four. And she takes two damage because of retaliate. We're going to swing for four. One, two, three, four. We take a damage because of retaliate. And then, I don't know, we can just have fun at this point, because we can just uh, throw away a double, use team building uh, to deal nine damage onto him. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We get retaliate one, which is fine. We can use the scimitar to deal two more damage. One, two. Uh, we get retaliate, which is fine. I don't care. Um, and then we can throw away two more cards to do psychic assault, or yeah, psychic assault deal one, two, three damage, and we get retaliate for one. Oh yeah, Wolverine has piercing. One, two, three. Phoenix is so good.